Hello everyone, come with me while we go ahead and take a look at the new mini clock Wi-Fi security camera. So first things first, of course we have the box itself, a manual, and of course the camera. So just taking a quick little look at it here, you have the SD card slot on the bottom, so it's very discreet and well hidden, the power plug so you can plug it in, and the general functionality for the actual clock, which does work. And of course the power plug. Okay, so now let's go ahead and take a look at how to get it set up through the TU application. Go ahead and click Add Device and then select Camera and Lock on the left hand side. And then you're going to select Smart Camera 2.4 and 5 GHz. From here it's going to essentially follow the prompts to go ahead and connect it to your home Wi-Fi. And you're, once you get to this point, you're going to go ahead and show your physical phone to the camera as seen here. This will allow it to register. Once you hear the prompt, you can then hit I Heard a Prompt and it will then go through the actual connection process. It doesn't take too long as you'll see here in just a moment and once that's connected you'll be able to view your camera whether you're uh, at home or away. So here's just a quick little live view image you can see there and then briefly I'm going to show you some of the different settings for the camera. So on the top right you have the three dots and this will take you into your device settings. You have a bunch of different options in regards to even just your basic functionality, detection settings, record settings, the full nine yards and even access to format your SD card if needed. So briefly I'm just showing you some of the different options here. And then we'll go ahead and back out and I'll show you some of the live view options. So you can do some of the basic setup here directly from the interface while viewing it. So turning on motion activation, doing your playback, and even manually telling it to record and or take pictures. So you'll see here, at least in the playback, it's a little uh, drag bar essentially to be able to slide through your time frames. Now I'm just doing a little demonstration so that you can view it for the manual recordings. So we're going to go into the gallery, and there's the picture and the little video that was just taken. And you can of course save these directly to your phone as needed. So on this note, let's go ahead and take a look at a couple different quality demonstrations. And of course, if you'd like to get more information in regards to this product, check out our website, spycenter.com, and don't forget to like and subscribe for future review videos.